the event, the geocaching event. Greetings folks, it's the end of the Caching the Bay geocaching event. There's the sign-in log and you can see all the many, many, many names of people that were here enjoying the event. I'm getting ready to leave, but before I leave, I wanted to share the interesting sights of Kelly Park here in San Jose. There's old railroad memorabilia. There's a lot of neat old buildings. Let's look at some. This is the old Dashaway Stable Building. Lick Livery and Hack Company. Very cool old building. A lot of these buildings have a whole lot of history and I don't want to do a long video about the history. Uh, in fact, I don't know all the history. So I'm just going to show you some of the buildings and if it sparks your interest you can look it up or come down here someday. It's a lovely park. It's an old pioneer wagon. Over there is the Portuguese Historical Museum. A really cool gazebo. Another re really neat looking house. That's the old dentist office. And here's an old blacksmithing building. And this is the old trolley barn. So many cool sights. Yes, you can go into some of these buildings and get the full tour or look around at all the exhibits. This might be one of my favorite ones. This says use associated gasoline and look at those old gas pumps and look at that old truck. Train tracks run through this part and there's a look at some of the picnic area down in here. This is where our event was held. We had people from all over. And here's where we took a group photo. This is actually the fire station. Check out those red doors. Rosie the Riveter is here. What a beautiful wraparound porch on that building. And the old wooden one over there was used to store fruit. It's like a fruit barn. And I believe uh, plums that were used to make uh, prunes in the heyday of this area are the highlighted fruit. These buildings over here were for the farm workers. They remind me of the tiny houses that we're all so infatuated with now. <laughs> Pacific Hotel across the way, down this little side street some very neat old buildings. There are a lot of signs here that tell you the history of each and every one. Again, I could probably do a whole video on each building. Here's an old schoolhouse and I read on the sign here that the boys and the girls were separated in this school. <laughs> This corner of the park is dedicated to the Vietnamese culture. And again, you know, a whole video could be done just 
in this one area. Very interesting sculptures. This museum must be super interesting. I did not go inside. It's just so much to see. There's a handful of geocachers. Even though the activity or the event is over, you know, everybody's still hanging out. Not everybody, but there are a few people still hanging out, still trying to figure out some of the puzzle caches and the gadget caches and doing the adventure labs. Here's a spot I didn't even notice until right now. Oh. Wow, there's just so much going on here. I'm going to wrap it up with a view of this Chinese cultural museum, which again, I just didn't have time to explore all these places. We were so busy with our event. Um, this Kelly Park is worth coming back to and taking your time and really exploring all it has to offer. This historical part of Kelly Park is just one part of the entire park. It's a huge place in San Jose, California. But it is time for me to move along, say goodbye to my friends, wrap up the day, and say goodbye to you guys for now. I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Take time to wander. Bye for now.